over all the years we've taught officers, you know, uh, domestic violence training, uh, critical incident training, homicide, shooting at the range. Uh, but over all the years, nobody's ever taken care uh, of the officers themselves. And uh, to police well, you have to be well. Uh, my name is Renee Landa. I'm a retired uh, chief of police from the South Miami Police Department and currently uh, working with Boulder Crest, uh, which we are focusing 100 percent on on officer wellness. We're here live today at the South Florida PBA. Uh, we have another uh, course that we'll be completing today. Uh, our course is usually a five day Monday through Friday course once a month. And what we do is we bring in officers from all of Dade County and really uh, all over the country have joined us today. We have some officers from uh, Pennsylvania and uh, a commander from uh, San Francisco. So, um, you know, people have been hearing about this. This is uh, the third year that uh, we've been uh, putting this on, and uh, people have come from all over the country. We've basically gotten almost 16 to 18 states that have picked up this same exact uh, training of officer wellness. <clears throat> and the goal of the entire thing is, um, over all the years we've taught officers, you know, uh, domestic violence training, uh, critical incident training, homicide, shooting at the range. Uh, but over all the years, nobody's ever taken care uh, of the officers themselves. And uh, to police well, you have to be well. And uh, this is what the focus of this class is. Uh, Boulder Crest, the company that really has supported this entire thing, has been there from the onset. They've taken this to a, a new high. Uh, and again, our, our goal is to constantly, uh, you know, take care of our officers. Uh, the, the known fact is that each and every single one of us uh, in this lifetime will always struggle. And uh, you, you have officers on the street that struggle with uh, personnel problems and issues, and yet they have to, you know, don a uniform, pin on a badge, and go out and take care of other people's problems and issues. And if they're not right up here, uh, then they can't police well. And that's what our goal is. Our goal is to make sure those officers have a, a, a beautiful family life, and that's what they deserve.